This is an update video to a previous video I uploaded regarding water pump comparisons for a 6.7 Cummins, or really any Cummins for that matter. I replaced my original factory 2012 6.7 Cummins water pump with this Boztec unit here. Uh, what intrigued me was that it was an all metal design and you know it looked pretty rugged. So after about 8,000 miles in two years, I actually developed a leak on this. Um, the water pump itself is still good. It's, I'll try to hold the camera and show you. You know, that's still good. It moves nice, free, it's not loose. Nothing's broke or anything, but the water pump itself is okay but it was the seal that uh, developed the leak. You could see all the corrosion around the water pump itself. But uh, I checked for codes the one day and I noticed there was a P2457 and it was regarding the, the EGR and cooling system and whatnot. And long story short, where I park, I looked and I actually saw some coolant that dried up so I took a look underneath the truck and I noticed that I was coming out the bottom of this water pump so quite disappointing but it is what it is. I ended up changing out this Boztec and I went with the bulletproof diesel unit that they have. Relatively new product they have but um, I installed that here on the truck. A shiny unit down there. So far it's doing its job. Um, to note the, uh, the seal for that water pump was definitely higher quality than that one that came off the boss deck and from what I remember it was better quality than the, the factory OEM one. So that was comforting to see and they actually advertised that seal part of the water pump on Bullproof Diesel's website, so that was pretty cool. Uh, other than that, it's uh, that new Bulletproof Diesel water pump. It's all metal design. Supposedly it has like a cooling fin on the outside there and keeps better balance and whatnot. But uh, like I said, so far it's, it's doing its job. It's holding up, no leaks and everything. So hopefully I get a good long life out of it and we could go from there. That's this update with this water pump. I know my previous video comparing the two, not the greatest video in the world, but it does have some good points to it. So, okay, until next time, take care.